Welcome back to the Kids and Money series. You want to be money smart? We're here to help. And today we're going to be talking about saving your allowance. If your parents give you an allowance, where do you store it? Should I keep my money under a pillow? Should I keep my money in a shoe or a hat? Take your money to the bank. What if they lose my money? Lots of people take their money to the banks. Can I get my money back anytime? When you give your money to a bank, it's called a deposit. Banks keep your money safe. And more importantly, the bank will pay you interest every month you keep the money in your savings account. You're probably thinking, wait a second, banks pay me money and I don't have to do anything? Why in the world would a bank pay me money to do nothing? It's like they are borrowing money from you until you want it back and even pay you for doing that. Often banks need a minimum deposit to open up an account. So start putting your money aside and into your piggy bank. A robot one that's blue and gray, and I have a Batman one that's gray and black. And which, what color is yours? I have a crown one that's um, pink and silver. It's pink. next week where we'll be talking about saving money and saving goals and don't forget to check out other videos in this kids and money series just seeing the kids see things in the stores that they want to buy and so even if it's just a dollar or two instead of saving that they buy these dollar or two things and then when they want something problem for some adults. Mm. Yeah, it's for everyone. <laughs> okay, so what tips do you have for us today? All right, um, one of my biggest tips, and this is something that I implement at home and I have the kids do, and we also do it with our adult money, um, take the money that you need to spend, like if you need something, that goes first, and then the things that you want, if you have enough to buy it, okay, um, but if not, you would put it all in a savings account. Now, one thing that my kids do is if they earn money from chores, half of the money they can put in a spend area, and the other half they will put in a save. We have like a little special piggy bank for saving that they'll put in their bank account later on if they want to. Um, and then that kind of helps them to know that you can't just spend all your money at one time. You got to save a fortune.